only on Christ 17 TV, back upside your head with another one. Today, we got the Sacramento Kings, Toronto Raptors, DeMar DeRozan, and Drake. So, maybe about a week back, Sacramento traveled to Toronto to play the Raptors. They were retiring Vince Carter's jersey for the Raptors. That's a great thing because Vince was one of my favorite guys. And DeMar DeRozan used to play there for a long time. And he's one of the top three Raptors of all time. So, since DeRozan is from Compton, he rides with Kendrick Lamar. So Drake unfollowed him, talked some shit. So he was on the sideline, and from what I heard, he called DeRozan a pussy from the sidelines. DeMar didn't pay it, no mind. And after this, Drake said he was going to pull DeMar's jersey from the Raptors if his jersey ever got retired like Vince's. So what... Being classy, DeMar said, well, he's going to have to make a long climb. He didn't feed into it or nothing. So, Drake's trying to, trying to start some bullshit, but I would, I would say this. DeMar DeRozan will kick Drake's little fucking Nickelodeon ass, okay? I know that. Drake knows that. Everybody knows that shit. So, last night... Toronto comes to Sacramento. And it's a close game all the way to the fourth quarter. And then the Kings fucking take off. I mean, they go on like a 19-2 run and just put these guys away. The Rosen balls out. He had like 27, 26 somewhere. And was hitting some clutch, clutch plays. The three... Got fouled and won. Hit the shit, four-point play, all kind of shit. So when the game is done, the owner for the Kings, the owner, he has a shirt on that says, they not like us. And I thought that was the coolest shit ever. Like, I got your back. I got your back. You play for us, I got your back. And then Kendrick just started blaring in the golden one. They not like us. Man, I thought that was the coolest shit. But look here. Drake, leave that shit alone. We all know you're not no tough guy. You're not going to beat nobody ass. So don't call nobody no pussy. Because saying that will get you punched right in your face. But see, DeMar held himself like, like a man. You know what? Talk your shit. You ain't going to put no hands on me. You ain't going to come on the court. It's all good. I'm playing ball. I'm getting paid. I'm doing my thing. He's not going to knock DeMar off his square to get suspended, fine, and maybe even Drake is the type of motherfucker who will press charges on you. So I thought that that was real smart of him, not even biting into it, not saying nothing back to him, not talking trash back to him. Go ahead and talk. You got bodied by Kendrick. I mean, your career is damn near done. You got all of your money, but that one song killed your whole career. Might be a minor, all that shit rocked your wig back, okay? Because <laughs> they not like us. So with that being said, I'm just going to say this. Drake, fall back. If you're going to make music, make music. But quit quit the tough guy shit. You're not no tough guy. We never known you for doing a motherfucking thing. So please just fall back. Let my man play ball. Don't talk shit to him. Don't do shit. If you want to talk shit, go talk shit to Kendrick. Kendrick's the one who bodied you. And put your career like this, spiraling down like a plane crash. So I just had to say that because I seen the shit. We beat the shit out the Raptors. The owner has on a shirt to say they not like us in response to Drake with Drake's shenanigans in Canada. He on the sideline talking shit. Keep going, you pussy. Like, 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 yo, my man. Knock it off. 
everybody knows you're not a tough guy. You're from Nickelodeon, and you like young little girls. Keep your sister away, <laughs> type shit. So with that being said, man, hit that like, hit that subscribe, it won't cost you a dime. Like I tell you every time, around this time, mind your business. Mind your business, fall back, because when you don't mind your business, you might get punched right in your face. I'm not going to lie. It happens all the time when people put their nose in other people's shit. So with that being said, I'm Christ17TV, and I will catch you guys on the flip side, player. Go Sacramento Kings. DeMar DeRozan was a hell of a pickup for us, and I see the Kings doing big things this year because now we seriously got a big three. DeRozan, Fox, Sabonis. See y'all in the playoffs. Catch you on the flip side, player.